she her, she made a girl get pregnant so they can have a baby together because she's a lesbian. And then she left the bitch. <laughs> she can't pay child support because she ain't no man and they can't get a DNA test. The baby would never belong to her. That's a cold bitch still. That's a uh, Brit He said Brittany. Her name's Brittany Griner. Brittany Griner had had a bet let a bet let a woman have a baby for her ass. A baby. And left the bitch. <laughs> Man, that's what I'm talking about. Brittany Griner is a real nigga. Here's some more BS. I mean, we got to go women and men's sports. They're not equal. They should be paid equal. They should be enjoyed separately. Well, now, in all respect to the great Serena and Venus Williams, they put asses in the seats. That's why they make the money. That That's why they get paid the big bucks. But I don't know any other people that get paid the big bucks. I think female golf, maybe. Other than that, that's about it. Track, oh, track and field depends, you know, you know. But, no. What do you guys think? For sure, like, we deserve equality, so definitely should. On topic of women's sports, can you name any WNBA teams? <laughs> women's sports just, like, don't get... And there you go. <laughs> there you go. I bet they can name an NBA team. There you go. As much publicity or as much attention as men's sports. What's the WNBA team that plays here in New York? Oh, I have no idea. I mean, women. The New York Liberty. And I've been in New York. Uh, I don't know where they are, but okay. Uh, who is this motherfucker? Oh, Lord. Okay, let me hear this bullshit. Deserve equal pay. Uh, they do equal amounts of work. Can you name any uh, WNBA players? No, I can't. Uh, I, I don't like sports a lot. Uh, yeah, I don't know. But I think you could probably name some NBA players, right? I could, and I think that's because it's a lot more publicized. Who's your favorite men's <laughs> Because you watch it, motherfucker. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. Basketball player. Do you, do you have a favorite basketball player? Stephen Curry. Stephen Curry? Okay. Do you have a favorite women's basketball player? I f no, 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 no. Got her name. <laughs> so do you think we should apply that to the NBA and the WNBA too? They're both playing the same sport women are equal to men so i don't say why not poor kid man no 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 lebron is not <laughs> is uh, what that uh, man i know a bunch of old wba players uh let me name some wba players man uh, Candace, man, a lot of them are retired. I'm trying to name some current ones. Uh, there was one from Nigeria, that, but she she doubles as an analyst. Oh, the one that went to jail. She's actually from Texas. Uh, I can't remember her name either. Uh. But I know she got a girl. She she made, her, she made a girl get pregnant, so they can have a baby together because she's a lesbian. And then she left the bitch. <laughs> she can't pay child support because she ain't no man, and they can't get a DNA test. The baby would never belong to her. That's a cold bitch still. That's a cold bitch still. <laughs> man. 
Can you name any WNBA teams or WNBA players? Uh, the the New York Liberties. That's right, yeah. That's about as far as I'm gonna go with WNBA. Can you name at least like any any players, any WNBA players? Damn, and I know one off the top of the head. It's not gonna come off. You don't need any WNBA players? No, I really don't. I mean, like I ha I know their faces, but I'm terrible with names. What about you? You think can you name any any of them? I could either. I'm. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just as bad at I have terrible memory, so. What about the WNBA team that plays here? You know, you guys are, are you guys New Yorkers? You were, I am like, a New Yorker, but I didn't know, I didn't even know. And the Liberty plays? NYC, right? They're great. Yeah. So can you name five more teams? Oh, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> favorite uh, men's basketball player? Now I can name five more teams. You know what? I don't think I can, but I'm gonna give it a shot. The Phoenix Mercury. The Connecticut team, but I don't know the basket. Connecticut. I don't know. Connecticut. They got one in Connecticut. Um, they got one in Dallas. It's called like the Dallas something. Uh, the Los Angeles Sparks. The, uh, the 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 uh, Minnesota um, the Minnesota Lynx the Minnesota Lynx I know the Minnesota Lynx for some reason uh, the Washington Mystics maybe. Indiana Fever, but they may be expired. Uh, oh, the Seattle Storm. I think they are out there. Uh, man, this is one of the worst tests, dude. I'm going to make an F on this mother. Um, I think Shaq is really funny. Who's your favorite women's basketball player? Someone on the Utah's <laughs> women's basketball team. We're from Connecticut. So you, you guys can name one NBA player, I'm guessing, right? You guys yeah, can I do can that. Name an NBA player, yeah. Well, can you name it? Can either you name a WNBA player? No, I cannot name a WNBA player. I can name women's soccer players. Give us a few women's soccer players then. Uh, <laughs> what's her name? Oh, uh, Rappy Gnome. Okay. Uh, Hope something. Um, I don't know. That's about it. One who's trapped in Russia right now. I forget her name. Do you know what I'm talking about? That's right, yeah. I'm going to give you her first name, and let's see if you can get the last name. Ready? Brit. Okay, that's the bitch I was talking about, the one that was trapped in Russia, the one that made that girl have a baby for her, and she fucking left her after the baby. Now, don't sit up there and talk shit about me and y'all, ladies. Bitches ain't shit. Uh, Brit he said Brittany. Her name's Brittany Griner. Brittany Griner had had a bit, let a bit, let a woman have a baby for her ass, a baby, and left the bitch. <laughs> Man, that's what I'm talking about. Brittany Griner's a real nigga. Spears. Not a basketball player, but good try. Who's like a famous basketball player that you know? That's right, yeah. I'm gonna give you her first name and let's see if you can get the last name. Ready? Oh, I forget her name. Do you know what I'm talking about? That's right, yeah. I'm gonna give you her first name and let's see if you can get the last name. Ready? Brittany Spears. Not a basketball player, but good try. Who's like a famous basketball player that you know of, a men's basketball player? I mean, all I can think of is Michael Jordan, to be honest. But the, the hard question is, can you name a women's basketball player? No, I actually can't. What do you think about that argument? Th now I'm a little older, so I can name a bunch of older basketball players. I remember Tina Thompson, Lisa Leslie. I remember Cheryl Swoops. I remember uh, Western Peace, Kim Parrott. I remember uh, uh, Cynthia Cooper. I actually met that lady. Uh, uh, I mean, Diana Taurasi. Um, JaVale McGee mama. <laughs> uh, oh, Pam, Pam McGee, you know. So, uh...
Oh, uh, uh, Cheryl Miller. Cheryl Miller. Uh, Cheryl, I mean, but Cheryl Miller didn't play in the NBA. I don't think she did. You know. Cheryl uh, Miller scored 105 points in a game and couldn't make the NBA. That tells you a lot about the difference between women and men as far as uh, playing sports against each other. You know. People say women's uh, sports should get paid the same as men's. Do you think that makes sense? When women get to the point where they can attract as many fans and they actually deserve the same income, then then the argument can be made. But I've seen that argument across like all sports, and I don't really think it, it's fair. But, yeah. Shout out to men versus street on that one, bro. Shout out for man versus street. Man, I'm subscribing. I'm subscribing. I'm clicking all. There you go. Shout out to Men vs. Street. 